For those that don't know our intricate love story, we met in Dubai. Let me set the scene. I was alone, very alone. <laughs> Six weeks into a new country, I was out ready to cause as much carnage as I possibly could. So I strolled into veracity, as you heard earlier. Not a friend in the world. In my mind, looking amazing. <laughs> but in reality, probably not so much. I looked up at four lovely young ladies walking on their way home. That happened to be Sarah and her friends. And I stumbled past them and shouted at them all and was like, look, why are you leaving? I've just arrived. <laughs> they all left. Um, <laughs> very quickly left. On behalf of the staff and management at Newton Hall and the Northumberland Registration Service, I would like to welcome you all here today to celebrate the marriage of Richard and Sarah. It was a couple of days after that that Sarah and I met again and arranged our first date. Little did we know it was the last first date we'd ever go on. Do you, Richard, take Sarah here present to be your lawful wedded wife, to be loving, loyal and faithful to her for the rest of your lives together? I do. And do you, Sarah, take Richard here present to be your lawful wedded husband, to be loving, loyal and faithful to him for the rest of your lives together? I do. If you live to be 100, I want to live to be 100 minus one day, so I never have to live without you. Piglet sided up to Pooh from behind. Pooh, he whispered. Yes, Piglet. Nothing, said Piglet, taking Pooh's hand. I just wanted to be sure of you. We'll be friends forever, won't we, Pooh? Asked Piglet. Even longer, Pooh answered. If ever there is tomorrow, when we're not together, there's something you must always remember. You are braver than you believe, smarter than you seem, and stronger than you think. But the most important thing is, even if we're apart, I'll always be with you. Sarah, I promise to care for you, to remain true to you, and above all, to love and respect you always. Richard, I promise to care for you, to remain true to you, and above all, to love and respect you always. It's a very proud occasion to walk uh, your daughter up the aisle, and Sarah looked absolutely fantastic with you. Sarah and Richard. You have both made the declarations required by law and have made solemn and binding promises to each other. It therefore gives me great pleasure to say you are now united as, as husband and wife in marriage and you may seal it with a kiss. Firstly, Sarah, what an absolute weapon you are. Well done. I'm absolutely so delighted to be here today, standing as Sarah's husband and looking out at all of our loved ones who have joined us on this very special occasion. Sarah, you're the most amazing partner anyone could ask for. You fill my life with so much fun and laughter, and I feel incredibly lucky to be here and be able to call you my wife. You are my constant support, my rock, and as I've said many times already, I feel very lucky.
Richard, I just want to wish you and Sarah all the love and happiness in the world. You mean so much to me. You're embarking on a new chapter together now as a couple. I know you're going to make the most of every moment. So one more time, can we just raise a glass to Richard and Sarah. Congratulations. May your love flourish and continue for many years to come. Cheers.